Makaha man was sentenced today to a year in prison after a judge said his case was the worst animal cruelty he's ever seen. David Lanny Moore was convicted on 24 counts of animal cruelty in May. Jen Boniza has more from today's sentencing. Jen? Joe David Moore and his mother June were both convicted of animal cruelty after police rescued hundreds of dogs from their no-kill animal shelter in 2016. Judge Edward Kubo addressed Moore sternly, letting him know he considered the grotesque and serious nature of how many animals were victimized. What I saw and what the jury saw were animals who are being treated worse than animals. Judge Edward Kubo reprimanded David Lanny Moore in court before sentencing him to one year in prison. Moore was also ordered to pay more than $39,000 in restitution to the Hawaiian Humane Society. Moore was convicted of 24 counts of animal cruelty after 310 dogs were seized from his no-kill shelter, Friends for Life, in October of 2016. Moore addressed Kubo saying he was called by a higher power to care for the animals and only had good intentions. There was no intent ever to hurt a human or an animal. Kubo says the dogs were found in deplorable conditions and cages were packed so tight the animals could barely move. Moore's mother, June, was convicted on one count of animal cruelty. She was sentenced to four days in prison and one year probation. Before sentencing June Moore, Kubo said he wanted to make a point. There is a need to impress upon the defendant the seriousness of what it means to be cruel to an innocent animal. David Moore's attorney says he thinks the sentences handed down by Kubo were appropriate. I'm happy at the result. Um, it's a sad situation. Uh, these are good people, but I understand uh, the judge's position. So, uh, and I'm not unhappy with the verdict. Model tells me he is unsure if David Moore will file an appeal. The Hawaiian Humane Society says of the 310 dogs that were seized, 300 of them were nursed back to health and adopted. Joe.